I can't even begin to tell you the last time I did a meatloaf recipe. I, it's been years, I'm guessing. I don't, I don't remember. But uh, today's episode is brought to you by HelloFresh. It's a meal delivery system. I've been with HelloFresh for about two years. Every meal they've sent has been amazing. I mean, they've got these nutritionalists that, that work out these great meals. They take about 30 minutes to make. You can get them three times uh, a week. You can get them for two people. You can get them for four people. Uh, it's a great service. You could choose vegetarian or the classic box, anything you want. Go on their website and check it out and you can customize your boxes. Also, I have a discount code that you can use and that will get you $30 off your first week shipment. So check that out. Let me know what you think. And in the meantime, let me show you what the meals look like. They're really cool. Here's the first meal that came in the mail. It's pesto presto panko chicken, and it looks absolutely delicious. All this is already measured out what you need for the whole meal. It comes in one little bag and you just rip it open, you start cooking. It's gonna take less than 30 minutes. If you've never tried a service like this, it's really cool. This is what this meal should look like. Here's meal number two that came in the mail. It's called Little Ears Pasta, and they got these, they look like little ears. It's kind of weird, creepy. But uh, you got the pasta bags here, sweet Italian sausage. There's, there's six of them. You get your Parmesan cheese, chili flakes, which means it can be spicy, beautiful um, broccoli, and more basil pesto for this dish. And here's what it's supposed to look like. Oh my goodness. Look how much is going on here. That's why I chose this one for today's episode. We have our meatloaf, the ground beef, onions, sweet potato, garlic, Italian parsley, honey, balsamic vinegar, Ketchup, two cage-free eggs. First time I've ever seen them ship me eggs. And then we have sliced almonds, green beans, and breadcrumbs. Let's get this recipe started because this is gonna be very tasty. Step one, preheat and prep. We're gonna wash everything and prep all the ingredients and get them ready to go. So as you can see, I've prepped everything. I've cut up the garlic and the onions, grated my onions, cut up the parsley. I even uh, went and cubed up this, which isn't for another step, but I did all my prep work, so everything's prepped and washed and ready to go. Step two, shape meat loaves. Now it's time to make our meatloaf. We got the meat in there. We're gonna put our, our garlic. Gonna do a little bit of salt in here. Throw my parsley in. Put in our two bags of panko breadcrumbs. Here's the second bag. And the recipe only calls for one of these eggs. They tell you, keep the other egg and use it as you need it. So put our one egg in. Tap, that one cracked. There we go. Put a little pepper in also. You can't put salt in without pepper. Get our, our onions that we grated, throw those in. You can wear a glove if you want, I'm not going to, but you just wanna get in there, make sure your hands are washed, and mix up all this. As you can see, I've shaped them into kind of like loaves and stuck them on a, you can oil a cookie sheet. I'm using this nonstick mat that I like. We're gonna take our two jars of ketchup. We're just gonna paint the tops. You put it on how you like. Step three, cook meat loaves and do sweet potatoes. Now place this in the oven at 450 degrees. You're gonna cook it for about 25 minutes. Place them in a stock pot or a big one-handled sauce pot or whatever you got. And you wanna put in enough water to cover it just about an inch above the potatoes. And we're going to soften these till they're fork tender. Each stove's differently. So just bring them to a boil and then simmer them until they soften up. Okay, so we're gonna prep this real quick. Got your green beans in a bowl. Real simple, little olive oil on it. Little salt, little pepper. Give them a little toss around. Step four, roast green beans. Now the meatloaf's been cooking for about 10 minutes. It's really hot. You wanna be really careful, and you wanna place your green beans on the pan now, back in the oven, another 15 minutes to finish off that 25 minute cook. Step five, mash sweet potatoes. Let's work on those sweet potatoes. They're now out of the, out of the pot, and they're all beautiful and soft. I'm gonna throw my butter in on here. Let that melt for a minute. I'm gonna drizzle on my honey. It came in the packet. Fun part is smashing this all together. 
And then after five minutes of getting nowhere with a fork, you finally give in to the potato masher. Look how beautiful that looks. Those roasted green beans look amazing. We're gonna slide under that meatloaf right there. We're gonna place it right here. One right there. Step six, finish and serve. We are only missing one little thing. We're gonna take these sliced almonds and just add a little flavor, a little crunch to this. Look at that. There it is, meatloaf balsamico with some sweet potatoes and green beans with slivered almonds. That looks like a professional dish. Here we go. Oh, that meatloaf rocks, hold on. Honey and butter sweet potatoes. And look at this, look at this. Mmm. Wow. Thank you, HelloFresh. Another home run. Guys, use my discount code. $30 off your first week's order. Mm, I'm drooling all over myself. It's unbelievable. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Take care.